and welcome to this week's Question of the Week with WCU TV. We're here where the Earth Club and the Sustainability Council are tabling for their upcoming event, Awaken the Dreamer. This is where we're going to be asking students the question of the week, which is, what is sustainability? Or, what does sustainability mean to you? Let's see if we can get some students. What does sustainability mean to you? Well, I think it's all based on biodiversity and soil fertility because, I mean, that's the basis of ecology and that's what sustains us ultimately. So if, if we don't have that, you know, we're all going to die whether or not we, we can, you know, live in a fancy house and have a car or whatever. But we need to also be careful with what we make sustainable because if we just apply sustainability to how we live now, we're still going to have sustainable prisons, sustainable traffic jams, and all this other nonsense. So let's um, work on making a fulfilling life for people and then make that sustainable. I would say that sustainability means, I mean, definition-wise, it's just being able to not be so disposable in our everyday life. Um, I know I saw the movie Impact Man, and yeah, and that, it really, it really got to me because I think our society is just extremely wasteful and that if we spend more time focusing on quality over quantity, we'd be looking at a completely different world. Uh, not much. I mean, I have a Brita, but that's about it. <laughs> that still counts? I mean, in the recycling bins around campus, do you, if you, do you put it in there instead? Yeah, I mean, I, do, I try to do that. We recycle at my apartment, but... Um, the ability to, or the behavior that is reproducible on a, not just day in and day out, but decade um, by decade and century by century process. The ability for oneself or a group to maintain itself without the support of others outside of it. To uh, sum it up, the circle of life. What does sustainability mean to you? Being able to sustain the environment and keeping the planet together and everything green and growing and happy and everybody happy. And, yeah. Fantastic answer. Thank you very much for your time. Uh, to me, sustainability is the way that we as a human race engage with the environments around us, the way we allocate our resources to help prevent these uh, environments to decrease the way that we help live. Absolutely, yeah. No, what, what, does that, what does that entail? I mean, on a given day, what, what do you look at when you say, oh, that's, that's sustainable living, or like that's, that's sustainable, like, that's sustaining our you know, resources? What's, what's something that you see? All right, so for instance, um, we are currently in the process of building our rec center. Yes. Uh, they are going to be having solar power uh, for, the, for the environment and for the electricity for that. Right. Um, it's actually being built from all these resources that have been used in, you know, high energy areas to help prevent the deforestation of the trees and stuff like the wood that they use. Oh, yeah. It's in high energy areas. So they're using all these resources to build it to help the sustainability of the environment around us. So that's phenomenal. I, I didn't even know that. Yeah. That's that's great. Yeah, oh man. So uh, wow, our school is ahead of the time oh, then yeah. I guess. This is this is great. Yeah, exactly. Well uh, Taylor, thank you very much for your time today. All right, thank you very and uh, you have a great rest of your day. All right, thanks, you too. Yeah. Thank you. What sustainability means to me is living within your means, uh, both as far as your resources go, whatever those resources may be, natural resources, financial resources, uh, that's what sustainability is. Okay, sustainability is obviously a rather tough topic even for those who know a lot about it, but to me personally sustainability means living within our means with the planet. Currently in America, if everyone lived like we did on the entire planet Earth, we would need four Earths. Four. We don't have those. So we need to change our living styles and put the earth in nature and make sure we're living in a way that we aren't going to deteriorate and just use up all of our beautiful resources doing stupid things or misusing them. So we have to use them correctly, know what we're doing, and know the impact to change our current lifestyles. This week's question is what does sustainability mean to you? Uh, to me, sustainability uh, means recycling and doing whatever we can to make sure that our future generations have uh, clean energy sources and a nice environment. Alex? Um, 
Well, Andy, sustainability to me means really being in an equilibrium within the environment. Um, I, it's like whenever you go camping, uh, you leave it exactly as you found it, and that's pretty much the my idealistic view of sustainability. Sustainability means to me, um, you know, for one, one thing that comes to mind is conservation, you know, um, figuring out ways to power our schools, to power our homes, to power our world, um, but in a way that is sustainable because, you know, gasoline is finite um, as far as, you know, we're concerned because it takes way too long to form. And, um, you know, water, we don't exactly, we don't have access to all of it, so we need to find a way to sustain these resources, you know, while we are here and hopefully for generations to come. So that's what sustainability means to me. <laughs> sustainability means to me just keeping yourself together, your dreams, your goals, your family and friends, just keeping it all together for yourself and your goals and everything like that. So. If anybody has a pretty clear image of sustainability on this campus, I've made it to pretty much the core. So, Lindsay Silcox, what does sustainability mean to you? To me, sustainability cannot be summed up in a soundbite. It involves changing the basic mindsets of every aspect of our daily lives and the infrastructure that enables it. For example, what have you thrown away today? Where is a way? It doesn't exist, there's no such thing. We have to recognize the part we play in our disposable culture and start making efforts to change ourselves, others, and our society as a whole. This is WCU TV correspondent Andrew Lloyd signing off for this week's Question of the Week. And I hope that after all of these questions and all of this knowledge, you've become a little bit more informed about our cause or you know where you need to go in order to find out more about sustainability. Thank you, and have a great day.